What's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna basically tell you how to fix FPS dropping, frame dropping or stuttering issues you're currently having with Rocket League. So stick to the end guys, this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you will perfectly know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue. Before we start right into the video, I just want you guys to know or let you guys know that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right into my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys you would support my work on youtube a little bit and i'm gonna really really be thankful for that and i'm gonna thank you for that so anyways i would just say let's get right started so the first step i would recommend doing for everybody is going to be to navigate to the very bottom of your screen we're going to right click your taskbar and open up your task manager or just simply use the shortcut for that afterwards navigate to the top left corner of your screen clicking onto processes and what i want you to do next is going to be to click onto cpu and simply end every single task which is currently having too much cpu usage or gpu usage also click on that so i'm going to explain it to you too many applications background processes whatever running at the same time with too much cpu gpu usage on a below end or bad pc will cause fps drops or frame drops on the long term so you're avoiding this issue and helping you a lot with that by just simply ending those tasks and once you're finished with that i want you to end the task manager again Navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen, opening up your settings, navigating to gaming and sticking around the Xbox Game Bar. We obviously want you to turn this off because the Xbox Game Bar doesn't really come with any benefits besides impacting your performance really bad. You don't want that, so just simply turn this off. The next step is going to be to go once down, go to captures, and I want you to stick around background recording and go to record in the background while I'm playing a game and obviously turn this off because, I mean, it's really... Obviously, if you're recording something, you are uh, having less FPS and especially a low-end or bad PC, if you're recording something, it will impact your performance really bad. So either way, you don't, don't want to record something with Windows, guys, so just turn this off and come back once in a while to check if this is really turned off. Next up is going to be to click on the game mode and I can't really tell you not to turn this off or on. You need to check it for yourself because it's the system sp specifically and just stick with the setting which is working better and once you found it just simply go back once and hit update and security stick around windows update and no guys it's going to sound a little bit basic but trust me updating every single driver you could possibly update on your pc will help you a lot with every kind of issue you're currently having and also with um fps or some frame drops so just simply download the latest version of windows and once you're finished with that i want you to end this task and do the same thing for your graphics card so hit the application hit the browser and download the latest version of your driver just to provide the best possible performance in general for your pc and yeah guys that's it for the video i hope that i could actually help you out of this one if it was like that just leave a like a comment or a subscription i'm gonna really be thankful for that and i'm gonna thank you for that so anyways i would just say have a nice day see you in the next one and bye